With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Question here is that the food is transported to the different parts of the plant through. So here some options are given. First is the xylem, second is the ploem, third is the pith and fourth is the cortex. Okay. So when we're talking about the plants, we know that the transportation in the plants, okay, for the transportation of the plants, there is a no heart, no blood, and no other circulatory system like present in the human. So the plants need to a transport system to move their food and water as well as the minerals from one part from one part to the another part of the plant. So they use two different systems such as they use the two different systems which we call as the vesicular tissues. Two vesicular tissues are used to transportation. Okay. Transportation of the food and water. The first is called as the xylem. Okay. The xylem is used to move the water, okay, water as well as the solutes from the, it will move from the roots to the leaves, okay, of the plant. And the other part is the, other system is the ploem, okay, so this ploem moves the food, okay. Food substances that transport from the that forms in the leaves and then it transported into the rest of the plant parts. Okay, then here we can say that the phloem is the transporting system of the food in the plants. So the right answer for our question is the option number B that is phloem. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.